All right, people of the world. This is GTA Raj, and I'm a little bit late. To be fair, I'm only like 20 minutes late, give or take. But that's besides the point. So, yeah, um. Whew. All right, yeah, yeah. I actually forgot what I was going to say. I'm running on very, very low sleep. So, please do. Bear with me. Do 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 do. Oh yeah, I oh, yeah yeah yeah. Okay. Okay. So, now that everything's fixed with Forza, uh, not Forza, uh, uh, live streaming here, uh, I can now actually go back to doing my thing. Like, okay, on Friday, right? On Friday, the edit button was broken, so there wasn't much I could do. I had to keep the same title, thumbnail, and everything from the night before. Which was interesting, to say the least. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da. <laughs> Ra 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 Yeah, I've really got very little sleep. I also did go see the new Godzilla today, which was interesting. Um, Legendary Godzilla has always been one of those things <laughs> that have been ridiculously hit or miss. It, it's like Marmite, you either love it or you hate it. <sighs> oh, we're driving the Nova for a friend. <sighs> so, Legendary's Godzilla was interesting for me. Like I said, it, it's something you either love or you hate. And in my game, oh, the people in fury. That thing is gorgeous, but I'm gonna reset it and tune it properly. But yeah, no, um, Legendary's Godzilla is something you, you either love or you hate because it, it in the beginning it did things so wrong, but then. You get around to things like Kong versus uh, Godzilla versus Kong, and I'm like, that's great because the last minute, um, fucking Mecha Godzilla shows up, and it's like, what? Bro, bro did what now? But yeah, no. Um, what we're gonna do is give you the best. I mean, I could stick with white wall tires, because we're not we're not doing much with this car. All we're gonna really do is make it all-wheel drive. Give it a turbo, and increases brakes and maybe it's cooling. Oh wow, racing springs really lowers this. Ah, uh, just get the street springs. 
Yeah, no, um, as time goes on, Godzilla as a franchise gets better. Or at least the legendary Godzilla franchise is better. But it, all, it also comes with that caveat of getting more weird. Which, that in its own right is interesting as well. Oh, we need to give this clutch. We need to give it uh, this, this, and this. Yeah, no, we're 420 brake horsepower, and we're going to be revving it. But th this time around, they were trying to do something a little bit different, whilst also still remaining the same. Oh, we got seven for Horizon Life. Oh, it's been a week since I played this. Uh... I want to use Lara. Wow! Two, two gifted! Woo! I got a Ford Fiesta, a Blue Baker Bruce, and an Audi RS3. 300 again! A limo? Oh my god, game! You're gonna spoil me. Well, yeah, no, it was pretty good. You still have to deal with the whole Hollow Earth malarkey. Which, if you don't get that, yeah, you're in for a bad damn in all honesty. Oh, let's do a graphic. Uh, Harden gameplay? Whoa, 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 whoa. Did they change it again? Wait, what? Message center again? What? Oh. Alright. Wait, can I only change my graphic settings when I am name select accessibility hot gameplay get to the bonus? Whoa. That's fucked up. I'm going back. Oh. Oh, yeah, that, that's the thing. This franch this legendary franchise uh gets better as time goes on, fortunately. And yeah, you still have to deal with the whole Hollow Earth, which is basically an entire world that's underground. And it's an entire world. It's basically the place for Kaiju to go sleeping. Wait, can I only try and change graphic settings on the main menu? Oh, that's cool, bro. I don't care for this radio, though. I'll give, I'll give it that much. Yeah, can I not... Where the hell do I change graphic settings? Uh, I do own all the card packs. We've got all of these bastards. Oh, what the fuck's that thing? Oh, yeah, they gave us the... This one gave us Hot Wheels cars before they did the Hot Wheels expansion for, um, five. And a whole bunch of them came over, which was pretty cool. Yeah, can I not change my graphic settings? Uh, player less danger, change card, set. It's normally in settings. And then you've got game difficulty. Hot in gameplay. Oh, what? Wait, 
Wait, can I not go back to... This is interesting. I don't recall it being like this. What do I made them hide it? Because all I wanted to do is check my sentence and be like, hey, let me tell you. Na, 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 na. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, um... <sighs> I'm not gonna give away the plot of Godzilla First Empire. Not First Empire, uh, New Empire. Yeah, I can only do it from here. What the fuck? That's bullshit. I want extreme, we'll turn it off. Let's go extreme in all of this. Woo! Look at us go! We run an extreme. Well, uh, turn on, uh, turn on our V-Sync. Enable to force the game to match the rendering to the monitor refresh rate, despite disabling may result in higher frame rate. But... Uh, oh, we can't even take that off. Let's go 85 anyway. Wow. I forgot that Forza didn't allow you to change graphic settings like that in the main menu or in the pause menu. My, wait, my most successful car is the M3 GTR? Hey, yo? I also need to bring up OBS and see what bullshit is happening. Cause I've I've got a feeling that my camera's gonna lag or something. It all it always does with stuff like this. Oh wow, my my shit just changed real time. Na 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 na. Just bring this up. Oh. I mean, <sighs> you're on the wrong side of the road, buddy. Actually, it's, it's actually not. I would love to get one of these cars, but the rear is having teeth right now. Oh my god! This is back when cars were built like tanks. And they weren't just filled to the bloody teeth with modules and electronics. Like, they had electronics in them, like radios and stuff like that. But it wasn't to the same degree as what they are now. Because there's like AI sensors and everything everywhere. Alright, so, <laughs> racing time! Actually, you know what? You know what? You know what? Is there any more gauntlets? Ah, uh, la di da di da Let me see. Let me see. All right, Goliaths. Oh, there's the Colossus. Oh my God. I mean, I already did this? What? There's the fourth rail bridge. I mean, we could go to Fortune Island. Are there any road races that we've missed? Cause I could have sworn 
that we've done them all and got gold for all of them. Uh, that, oh wait, there's a new um, road rally trail. Or trail, not trial. Cross, for me, it, whoa. Wait a minute. There's one we haven't done. Oh, we have done them, but they're not like completed. Oh wow, there's a few here. Oh, what? A marathon. Oh, there's a new street race here from the 19... Ooh. Well, hello! Alright, alright, alright. Let's do this one. Woo! You know what, though? It's time for me to tour my car! Let's give my car that little bit of extra grip, shall we? Let's not go that far down. Um. One sixty four. Yeah, that should help. Ah, uh, wait, we didn't get any count. Oh, I get it. I get it. The springs are fine. Anti roll bars, not quite so much. Damping's fine. Here's an axe, fine. A little bit more on the brakes, and that's it. So this stream's gonna be a little bit more quiet than normal. Mainly because I'm bloody tired. And that's on me. Oh wait, should I not have just went and done acceleration? Oh, I'm gonna up. There was honestly nothing wrong with my setup there. Funnily enough, the handling and all that on this is a lot more realistic than you think. Yeah, well, let's do it this way. Uh, what is that way? Yeah, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna increase this a little bit. Um, increase our gear ratio. That way, we'll have more acceleration on all the gears. Actually, what we will do is turn the car. Reset. And we'll go down to 28 PSI. One, two, three. Oh, or to four, P an extra four on there. Uh, we want to increase acceleration here. We should still have around the same kind of top speed. Yeah. Yeah, this is now more suitable than it was before. Oh man, I've actually been here before as well. Yeah, 
Monument of Wayne's. So the 1990s collection is S1. You ready for a great championship this spring? Are you ready for a great championship? An S100 prelude? Ah, uh, I think not, buddy. What I'm going to do... Yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab that prelude. And I'm going to make it stock, and then I'm going to build it up myself fast one class, because this is going to be a street race. It even looks custom as hell. Kind of. But not quite. Back to the 1990s. Yeah, we'll quit the race, but we'll also do the thing next. So if we bring back our houses. Blair ours is mon. I forgot we own Edward Castle. Whoa, that's a fucking drag machine. Well, I can't even stop that. Whoa! Someone's broken this car. Edinburgh Castle! I want to go in there. I've never been in Edinburgh Castle myself. So yeah, what we want to do is we want S1 class for this car. Of course I need to fucking unlock it, holy shit. Dude, you know what? Horizon 4 has less issues overall than 5. Like, when you're, when you're moving the camera around by selecting uh, rims, there's no jitter from the frame. There's no frame jitter. Yeah. I mean, if, if you do this in Hor Forza Horizon 5. If you do this in Forza Horizon 5, let me move the camera around like that. And it's like... Oh, what did I just do? Yeah, I'll just take these. It's fine. Or better yet, um, yeah, these. Actually, no, no, no. Let's give it wider tires at the back and front. Ooh, all wheel drive. Cause keep in mind, we do have to make this S1 class and the best way to do that is give it uh, better times. Let's get onto these brakes now. I want it away. Do 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 do. Yeah, no. Um, this game has a lot less issues than Horizon One, uh, Horizon Five did. Because Horizon Five, not only has a lot more things broken in general with it, but when you're They've introduced new systems and over the past couple of years, right? As I came out with the donut media stuff. The at certain point you could pop up a menu to to um customize your car on the fly uh during the test track. Alright lad. 
And essentially, it was laggy and buggy as hell. Right, so we have up till um, S1 class, I think. I want to see what degenerates have made for this. You know what? Let's just give a weight reduction. Why the fuck not? This is now like a 900 horsepower or Honda Prelude. It's, it's insane. Alright, where's my... It's been a while, so I need to make sure I remember where all my shit is. Let's find new designs. Are there any degenerate anime designs on the source front for this? Anime check. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's take this one. I like the look of this degeneracy. We'll, we'll see in a second. But those anime titties. So we'll... Hey, 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 we got them anime titties. Let's fucking go. All right, let's get into photo mode. Woo! Zatanna? Holy shit, she can get it. Let's fucking go. <laughs> oh my god. This is why I like the custom design stuff in Forza Horizon. Yo, why are I be lagging though? Or not lagging, why am I frame stopping? I'm gonna force it to run a little bit better. It's benefit of PC. Plonk. Ah, this will do. Boop. Ah, we should be off the races now. Oh, let's fucking go. Alright, so we are driving the shit manual. So don't expect the best. Um... How long have we been alive for? 27 minutes. I'll do... I'll do this event. Should be alright though. Alright, let's fucking go. Ah, shit, I'm bumping up Edinburgh. Edinburgh's got that fucking actual proper street racing scene. Oh, what? Go suck a dick. Okay, I'm actually gonna have to turn my sentence down a little bit, so bear with me on that. Because I cannot stand the fact that she's jumping into actual fucking proper. Thank you. Yeah, the, sh the stupid part about this is that you can't actually return to the main menu of the game. You have to actually quit the game and then open it back up again. That's that's one of the downsides I'll give this uh, game. Is it still better than Forza Horizon 5? Yes. Yes. There's... <sighs> A lot of the tuning stuff you can get up to with this is so much better than what you can do in 5. 5 gives you more tuning components to work with, but the results are inaccurate to hell and back. And things just feel worse when you're uh, driving around the track or that. I absolutely hate it. So let's start a game. Let's turn down a bunch of the settings so I can keep a uh, smooth frame rate, like armor. There was one that I changed. Uh, shadow quality is fine. Get that shit to medium or low. Terrain. 
off SSR high lens effect share quality is fine everything else is fine static geometry quality let's put that variable all right all right let's go we should be we should be on the map for this one now Why are we hitting 170 though? I thought it was 85. Yeah, it is. Woo! Let's go. Alright, so we're going to jump back into that race. What I need to also do is tune the gears on the prelude. It's not much of an issue. It's just more of an inconvenience than anything else. Uh Welcome back, Peter. Yeah, whatever, welcome back, whatever. I've also got the sound turned down lower on the game simply due to the fact I'm gonna get hit up for copyright. Are oh, we gonna do 215? Do, 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 do. Uh, we could do 200. Actually, what's the default? Oh. So we could do this. For massive acceleration. And let's make all these gears a little bit slower. That should do it. Uh, aerodynamics, I want to go for speed. Brake pressure, it's only going to be a little bit extra. Springs, actually my right height should be uh, higher up. If I'm too low down, I can spin out for no reason. Tires. 26, 25, gearing alignment. Yeah, we'll get you now. At least I hope. Woo! Now, um, can I change audio? Because I need my audio to be a little bit louder. There we go. Oh, it's already 10. What the fuck? Whatever. To be fair, I'm not playing music, so uh, it works out. Okay, let's go to the racetrack. Oh, not the racetrack, sorry. Oh, man, this, this kicks ass. Yeah, we can just plow through this. <sighs> what I don't like is that this is not using my my uh, PC's onboard sound equalizer. So it sounds like a tiny piece of mass. Which is the downside of this, unfortunately. So now we can successfully compete in that um, race. Woo! I forgot this is a partial drift racer as well. So not only can we drift through the streets of Edinburgh, but we can look good doing it as well. Although I'm not proficient at driving. Um... I'm not professional at drifting in this. So there's that, there's that that I have to deal with. And I've got to make a bourgeois design. I've got to make up some bullshit to say just to try and bypass this copyright shit. Like, it's, it's, it's unreal, let's be honest. 
Let me tell you, the, the copyright situation with Forza Horizon 4 uh, is just unreal. It really is. Is this a lap? No. Just progression. It's like I know this place. Is it actually do? Let's go. This is one of the few times where downshifting didn't help. Damn. Edinburgh really hasn't changed all that much. Like, this was done in, like, what, 2018? So I'm assuming they used models and roadmaps and all that from Google from, like, 2017 or something. Which, which honestly, would make sense. Yeah, you win. It's fine. We've done it. Straight up, just done it. Is it just a one-time thing? Though? Wait, that's the McLaren. Whoa, I forgot we were against that. So, for the, for those who don't know, we prestiged in this, and prestiging just basically resets your rank, and you can re earn a whole bunch of stuff all over again, which is in. Incredible. Is there even anything new? What the? Poo! Taxi for takeoff? Oh my god. Okay. All right. All right. Let's let's uh do this. We we can race a plane. Let's go racing an airplane. See what happens. When it when it happens in game, it it's pretty good. Like, without a shadow of a doubt. Let's go, let's go, cockpit. A left-hand drive Honda? Why? Why not right-hand drive? We're in Scotland, of all things. Woo! See, I can handle a lot about tight turns. What I don't get though is why the range and all that's in Columbus. Fuck off! I don't want your bullshit. Get out of here. Get out of here, cockwumble. I refuse to partake in your bullshittery. I have my own bullshittery to partake in, thank you very much. Although I will say these gauges look fucking plastered on. Like to hell at a handbag. Yeah. yeah, that's the thing with the Forza Horizon games in general. Um, you're forced into the online stuff. Like, without. There's no asking if you want to join, they just put you in it. I'm like, what the fuck? That's some bullshit. Get out of here, you bullshit. Whee! Oh, 
All right, to be to be fair to myself in this uh, uh, part, I did increase my brake pressure, but at the same time, this controller is not as responsive as I'd like for that kind of stuff. I should have just stuck with the Xbox controller. For some reason, even though you can do it on the PlayStation itself, you can you can't seem to be able to change how much pressure you can give triggers. Which is a literal downside. But we are just going to get a bit of uh, manual driving practice in. And just see where we can go from there. Woo! Good lord, if I ever get my license. We can do some red light racing. Just don't sit there and rev your engine. Your in your car's in your car's engine doesn't like that. Oh really? It's just up here? I don't care! Fuck off! Your fucking quest bullshit sucks anyway, so fuck off. I you what to quit. Yes! There wasn't any other championship to begin with! Oh, what the fuck? It's just taxis. Ah, oh, we get to drive. We get to race a plane in a taxi. This is what I love for! You don't get to see this kind of bullshit in five. The best thing that happens in 5, in terms of showcases, is you racing a diesel train. A diesel train isn't anywhere near as entertaining. Oh, what? <laughs> Woo! Alright, P these villagers though. This is a pimped out fucking taxi, just for this festival. Shit spun out. Ah, oh, that's embarrassing. Let's go, holy shit. <laughs> Woo! Wait, we're in second? Fuck off. No way.
Ain't no way I'm gonna lose that fighter jet. I finished, did I get first? Yes, let's go! Taxi for takeoff. Yeah, this is why I like Forza Horizon 4. Like, you get to race like Fly Scotsman, you get to race hovercraft, you get to race against these fighter jets. And even uh, using a rally car, you can race guys on dirt bikes, which makes sense. But when you, when you get around to things like five, you're racing a diesel train. You're racing something else. Nice, nice, nice. Just what I wanted. I wanted. I've always wanted a golden skirt and a pair of knit trainers. Nice. Appreciate it. But now, um, there, there's very few uh, showcase events in Horizon Five. And I've already beaten Horizon Five. So it's kind of meh. yeah, we won that. I thought we already beat this. Yeah, we did. Um, you know what though? We'll just show all the showcase events because there's there's uh, I guess the. Uh, playing here. That's the Halo experience where you, Cortana is guiding you. And you've got to race, you've got to use the Warthog to get to the event. The, to, uh, you've got to use the Warthog to get to the end of the track. Then you've got a fucking, uh, what do we call it, a hovercraft that you have to race against. Fly Scotsman. Dirt bikes. And this. How did five get it so wrong? Like, huh? It is messed up. Yeah, we'll do this one again. But I am going to fast travel to it because holy. I'm not driving 11.5 kilometers just for that. There's no. There's no need for it. <sighs> right, so the monument wins. Come rain or shine, this spring. There we that's the thing we missed out on. I missed out on our part, so I've got to do that. We could use a Cossie if we wanted to. I'm not using a Cossie, I'm using my preload. So what I'll do is I'll do this race, and I'll do the other two pieces to it, and then we're Gucci. We got the old fashioned red telephone boxes? No. All right, the game thinks I'm winning too easily. I wholeheartedly disagree. But okay. Wait, is that a fucking speed 12? That speed 12 would wipe the floor after driving properly. Actually, I'll be that guy. The speed 12 is the fastest car here. Ask me how I know. It's just not... What? What just stopped me? What just stopped me? I can't even. Oh, 
Oh, I'm a brain dead idiot! I wasn't paying attention. And I forgot to see the turning point. Hey, Ferrari, get the fuck out of here. I'm not gonna lie, Forza Horizon 4 may still be broken with uh, some of his options. But, like, it's still a good game. It's still a very good game. Let's go! They just got debated by actual traffic. God! No, I didn't miss the checkpoint. Screw you! I went through it. I went through that fucking checkpoint. <sighs> the checkpoint system and Forza Horizon just shouldn't exist. It really shouldn't. I could have sworn that gear was a little bit faster. Oh my god! Why my acceleration suck? Fucking this one here. <gasps> this one is a literal slow and steady wins the race. And I'm here for it. Fuck. I just got robbed of a win. It's not the first time that's happened this race. This fucking horse shit.
three, four, break that. Acceleration is definitely a problem for this car. It's got a lot of power and it's a more of a high build up of anything. Well, I thought it gave us an overall drive share. Why is it slipping out like this? Yeah, no, that one was close. That one was kind of close. But I was let down by that wall. This one had nothing to do with the rubber banding, because both those cars are very capable. That Nismo GTR is just something fucking special. I'm telling you. Oh my god, I am out of it today. Are you kidding? Huh. <sighs> Alright, I'm too out of it tonight. So, early street, or not early stream, early end to the stream. So, we're going to leave it at that. If you've enjoyed yourself, leave a like, share the content around, turn on the notification bell, all that good stuff. Uh, be a channel member if you want to, click the join button for that. Uh, we have channel affiliate links in the description. So, if you want to support the channel, you can do so by... Using the links down below, I get a small kick back on whatever you buy with my links. You can also use code GTA Raj at checkout to save 10% off your order. Um, also, by the way, channel memberships also really do help. So if you want to do that, click the join button. I know I've already said it, but like you get extra content, e access to emoji and all that lovely, lovely stuff. But anyway, tomorrow night... <sighs> We're going to continue chapter two of Life is Strange. Um, not true color. We've been through a lot of that. <laughs> Tomorrow night, we're going to continue on through Life is Strange before the storm. We're going to continue on with chapter two. Get that finished and bada bing, bada boom. Let's see what else happens. Um, Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. I forgot. Let me go check real quick. I did the thing yesterday. Oh, I did the thing yesterday. Do, 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 do. Let me check, let me check, let me check just what I'm doing. Time. Not tomorrow, Wednesday. I kind of forgot what I was doing on Wednesday. Because I'm that bloody tired. Oh, fuck. Ugh. Tonight we dive into Fort Star Rising 4. Tomorrow is going to be Life is Strange Before the Storm. Wednesday is going to be Dragon Ball Z Sparking Neo. A.K.A. Dragon Ball Z, but okay, thank you, too. 
Then Legends of Ruin Terror will have the finale on Thursday. And then Friday is going to be League of Legends solo. Alright. That's going to do it for now. I hope you all have a great evening. Oh. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you all again tomorrow. 